Grand rising. I mean, good afternoon, everybody. My fault. I'm still thinking this morning. But good afternoon, or whatever state you in. Grand rising or good afternoon. Whatever time zone you in. But anyways, ladies and gentlemen, as we're coming into this very video, let's not forget to hit that like button, leave a comment, subscribe if you haven't already. If you're new here watching this video, but we are going to talk about monitoring spirits. Because I know if you are chosen and you stand outside from the crowd, trust and believe me, people are going to be watching you constantly, nonstop, even on your social media. But we're going to talk about that. We're going to dig a little bit more deeper into that. So with that being said, I'm going to need for you all to stay tuned at the end of this very video. So get your snacks, get everything that you need, sit your butt down. <laughs> and feast your eyes once again on this realness. Because we finna spill the realness in this thing. So I hope you are ready. But with that being said, let's get it, y'all. The topic today, how to protect yourself from modern spirits. Folks, I'm going to leave you the lesson. Number one, protecting yourself from modern spirits. Number one, you got to be low key. You cannot be out here flashing money, wearing fancy clothes. You can't be doing that because number one, you're already a target. Number two, they know you're chosen and blessed and highly favored. Number three, you don't speak the same language these people are speaking. Every time you open up your mouth and speak, you're speaking different vocabulary. They're still speaking like they in high school. They're still using that small little kitty vocabulary. Y'all using that grown man, grown woman vocabulary. And every time you open up your mouth and speak, they be like, huh, what'd you say? What, what, what that word mean? You see, they're not on your higher frequency. They still down here and you way up there. I'm talking about you so up there. Look, you can't even see my hand. That's how far and high you up right now. But these people are literally watching y'all. Gang stalking you. I bet you go to Denny's or Walmart, wherever you go. People is going to be staring at you. You got to protect your energy at all costs, ladies and gentlemen. You may be a public figure. You may be a YouTuber. But whatever you do and wherever you go, protect yourself. I don't mean carry no gun, no knife. No pepper spray, no none of that. Protect your energy. And be careful of the areas that you go. Because let me tell you something. Once you start becoming more popular in your city, it's time for you to change your environment. Because back then you wasn't big as you are now, but now you outgrow everybody in your whole city. And all these modern spirits, and by the way, Modern spirits means people lurking. AK lurking means watching, gang stalking, being nosy. But yeah, let's let's take it back. Yeah. These modern spirits got some type of mental illness towards them. Cause who in the Sam Hill got all this time to sit back and watch people? People that are not even concerned about them. But they're so concerned about your life because your life is a, once again an entertainment to them. They may hate your guts, but they send out watching, lurking everything that you are doing with an evil eye. That's why I'm telling you all, don't dress, don't come around these people dressed like you're a millionaire. If you got money, 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 or if you got some type of money, or if you're rich, whatever you got going on. Do not dress like you are rich. Dress like you ain't got nothing. I ain't say dress like you homeless, like a crackhead or a prostitute on the street. No, that's not what I'm saying. I'm saying dress regular. Dress decent. Don't try to dress like you at a Grammy Award or something. This ain't BET, this ain't MTV, and this ain't TRL. Dress regular, ladies and gentlemen. Because trust and believe me. But people start seeing you with all these flashy things. 
diamonds and all that. God forbid, somebody gonna end up gonna try to rob you or worse. So you got to be very careful out here. It's a it's a lot of hungry wolves out here. And they want some food. So guess what? They're gonna try to take off of your plate. And they're gonna try to take you up out of here. AKA this world. You are like a piece of juicy steak. A grilled steak on top of that. With A1 sauce. And you walk around here with jewelry, flashy things and all that. You about to, let me tell you something. You about to tuck that jewelry in or you about not wear it at all. As a matter of fact, I said tuck it in, but don't even tuck it in. Don't even worry because you're going to have a lot of people martyring you. And once they see you with all this jewelry on, trust and believe me, they're going to rob you. Mm-hmm. You got to be very careful of the environment that you are surrounding yourself by. Because let me tell you something. People got evil tuitions. Everybody ain't doing so hot in life. They want to see you doing hot. And you walk around here showing off your money. Talk about I'm this guy. I'm that woman. All right. Keep on. But God forbid. You stay low key, ladies and gentlemen. And rest in peace to PMB Rock. Y'all know what happened to him. That's what I'm saying. If you chose and you got all this jewelry on, they already jealous of you anyway. And then you just putting it jewelry on top of that, oh yeah, it's going to make these demons inside these people. It's going to make them want to do something to you because they already jealous. Then on top of that, they envy. And on top of envy, they are envious. These people are envious. You got to wake up. I don't care how close they are to you. The ones that's closest to you will do you in. The closest one, let me repeat that. The closest one will do it to you. And you think I'm lying? How many of you been betrayed before? How many of you been gang stopped by somebody and kind of found out it was your so-called friend? Because they were gang stalking you this whole time. Pretend to be your friend. And that's another thing I want to put out in this video. Be careful who you surround yourself by. Because these people know you chose and blessed and highly favor. So they are gang stalking your life. You got to protect yourself at all times, folks. Put on a whole army, a suit of army of God. Not saying don't be paranoid, don't be afraid, and don't be scared. Because one thing about us, we ain't never scared, but at the same time, we ain't that damn dumb. We are smart, book smart and street smart. And you got to know how to move out here. The people is lurking and watching you. You got to be careful. Because there's so much, excuse me, there's so much negativity going out here today. You might not turn on your TV and watch the news, but every time you go on social media, Something don't happen to somebody because of this, because of that. Because you know why? They wasn't being careful. They, don't, they ain't had their own. I cannot say this. They did not have that whole full army of God on them. The full army, the full suit of God. That's what I'm trying to say. These people was not surrounded by the right people. They wasn't beware of the surroundings. Because little do you know, people can watch you so hard, you could be driving in your car, and you're not even paying attention. Somebody behind you, ring your tags, and follow you everywhere you go. And they're going to know where you stay at, because guess what? They've been following you, and you won't pay any attention. Martyring spirits, folks. Come on. Let's wake up. Martyring spirits are real. I finna break it down to you. Shimmy, shimmy, y'all. This is the raw truth right here. Raw and uncut. When you about to get out of your city, let me tell you something. You already got modern spirits watching you. Whatever you do, you about not tell a single soul out here what you and God got going on. Let me give you an example too. That's imagine. You finna make it big out of your city. 
If you're going around telling everybody, you tell the mama, the daddy, the grandma, granddaddy, you tell the dog, a cat, even the little children. Now guess what? All your business out on First Street. Now everybody knows what you got going on. Even the president know. Because you wasn't being so careful. You just had to open up your mouth and spill the beans. Not only modern spirits are watching you, now you got the whole community watching you. And now these people are trying to put a stop to your plan. And next thing you know, God forbid, something end up happening. This, By the way, this is an example. Because I'm trying to put a picture inside your head when you're not careful. Next thing you know, somebody out there is trying to take over a body here. Somebody is trying to rob you. Somebody is trying to break into your house. You don't know what can happen. Because you are being watched. You open up your mouth too much. Shh. Close your mouth. Don't say a word. People are already watching you. Be low key. Remain mysterious. Don't let Shaggy and Scooby doing them trying to solve your mystery. It ain't none of their business. Y'all got to stay low key out here, ladies and gentlemen. This is very, very serious. This is a spiritual warfare we got going on right now. You got to stay prayed up out here. You got to stay prayed up. Because look at, look at the world we going, um, excuse me. Look at the world we living in right now. It's too much negativity. I wish I could wake up one day and then see no negativity. Everybody getting along. Peaceful. No modern spirits. But the devil is running this world. He running this country. And he jumping inside of everybody. Not everybody, but <clears throat> he jumping inside of certain people. Making them martyring you. Making them want to do something to you. But no weapon formed against you shall not prosper. In Jesus' name, amen. So let me tell you something. When you are chosen by the Most High, you're already protected. But at the same time, you got to protect yourself at all costs. Like I said, you don't need no gun, no knife, no pepper spray, no none of that. But there's no. Each and every single last one of you is being watched. Don't wear no fancy clothes, fancy shoes, jewelry. I ain't saying dress all raggedy. But when that is... When it's that time to dress like that, dress around the right people. Don't go around these hungry wolves, these ugly baffoons, and dressing like all sexy and all that. Because number one, they're going to get jealous. They're going to start staring at you. Who he think he is? He ain't all that. They can't come in here with that suit on. Come in here with that. He just make me sick. The demons inside these people are trembling and they are talking. Not only that, they are staring at you. You can feel the eyes when you come into the room. Here they are staring at you, monitoring you. The group of baffoons. And they tap in their little stupid friend. Look at him. Look at her. They think they all that. <laughs> this is what people are doing, folks. And you ever had saw this type of look when people look at you? They are watching you. They are jealous, envious. They want what you have. And you ever gotten them looks for somebody close to you or to your bloodline? Get out. Let me tell you something. The devil's inside of these people. They watching what you're doing on social media. You make out a YouTube channel and they're watching every single lesson, one of your videos. And they can't believe somebody like you in the community. They knew you since you was a baby. 
And then they can't believe you out there making big, big moves. And they're just watching your channel, scrolling. Breathing hard like a stalker. Like, they just get angry and angry and angry. Y'all got to be very, very careful, like I said. You got to protect yourself. Because if you don't protect yourself, you're going to slip up and find yourself in some serious BS. And God forbid, I don't want nothing to happen to none of you. That's why I am making this video. Every single last one of you is being watched. When you follow your own path, you be your own leader, your own man, your own woman. You think for yourself. Trust and believe me. You will be watched. It's like two parts. All eyes on you. All eyes on me. The cops watching you. The animals, the squirrels, they watching you. The grandma watching you. Granddaddy watching you. Strangers watching you. Hell, even the robots, they watching you. You can't do nothing. It reminds me of that 80s song. I always feel like somebody's watching me. And I have no privacy. Y'all can barely get any privacy. Because you're being watched. Everywhere you go. Wherever you shopping. Or shopping with your children. You're at the mall whatever. People is lurking. They watching. Especially if you got a YouTube channel. Or you got a podcast. Or you making big numbers on Instagram or TikTok. And they see you in person. Or they're going to be watching. And that's another thing I want to say. Change your environment like I said. You got to start moving. When it's time to move, you move. Don't sit there in the same hometown forever. Because cause sooner or later, people, everybody is going to be watching and talking. Let them talk. Let them stir. You can't stop people from staring at you. But the only reason why they're staring at you because they see the Holy Spirit in you. And you the Holy Spirit surrounded by a bunch of darkness. Which means you are surrounded by demons. And you got the Holy Spirit inside of you. Your spirit is making them demons feel some type of way right now. This is why they are monitoring you. Get away from these folks. You are an angel. You are a leader. You don't belong around no demons or a bunch of wannabes. A bunch of water color sugars. That's all y'all around with. A water color sugars. A bunch of losers. They already think you all that. Oh, he think he got all that. But you, you scrubbing your own self. But they think you got it all. Look at the way he dress. Look at the way she carry herself. She must live in a mansion. But they don't know your struggle. But they're still studying you. Watching you. Martyring you. People are that doggone stupid. They're staring at you for no, for no apparent reason. And people don't even know why they are doing it. But let me tell you why. It's the spirit of the enemy. The enemy got these people doing stupid stuff. They're not even thinking twice. Oh, I'm staring at him. I'm about to stop. Oh, I'm staring at her. I'm about to stop. No, they just keep on doing it and doing it and doing it. The spirit of envy. Jealousy. Y'all making these people feel weak. But. <laughs> it ain't your fault. And it ain't our fault. They feel like that. But if people are monitoring you and studying you and watching your every move, it's like every breath you take, they be watching you. Y'all remember that song back in the 80s? Every breath you take, every step you take, they are watching. Trust me and believe me, they are watching. But they only doing that for a doggone good reason. One damn good reason. Because you got something going on with yourself. You finna go to a whole nother environment doing big things. 
around other big winners. You understand? They staring at you because they want you to take them along with you. But you're not going to do that because everybody can't go where God is taking you. And they know this. And they know this, man. They know they can't go with you. But at the same time, that's why people are giving you that. They're giving you that stare. They're giving you that. And when people start doing that, get away from them. Pray for them and get away from them. Because people like that are mentally crazy. You understand? Do you understand me? People are mentally crazy. I ain't finna sit up here and study and monitoring somebody. I know doggone well I don't like them. For example, if I don't like somebody, why I'ma keep on staring at them and watching them? No way. Heavens no. I ain't wasting my time doing that. These people are wasting your time watching you. They, they're too busy watching us. But like I said, they can watch all they want to. They can sit down with their greasy, bootlegged popcorn and watch us all day long until they go to sleep. The only thing they're going to do is get mad, bitter, and pissed off. And we still going to be up here getting blessed like never before, folks. But I wanted to make this video because a lot of you, I feel like a lot of you is being gang stalked right now. You can't even go nowhere anymore because or you feel like you're a celebrity. Everywhere you go, people watching. That's a magic what Michael Jackson had went through. He couldn't go nowhere. Everybody knew him. Y'all like some damn celebrities. People staring, watching. Not only that, they asking questions. They want to know this about you, that about you. I mean, that's asking questions like you in an interview. This ain't Vlad TV. This ain't TMZ. This ain't none of that. This ain't 106 in Park. This ain't TRL. This ain't Rap City in the Basement. This is life, folks. And some people, that's because they see you on a camera screen. Spreading the gossip. A.K.A. spreading the truth. Or helping people, uplifting people. That they use some type of that they use some type of celebrity. But some folks see it in the wrong way. But idiots out here, they look at it wrong. Sure, you may got a couple of fans here and there, but some people, they don't know how to act when they see you. All they do is they stop and stare like an idiot. Like, dude, chill. Because these modern spirits, it can get annoying. And then once you catch them all, girl, you want to be like, dude, what are you looking at? But at the same time, keep your mouth closed. Don't say nothing. You already know why they stirring. You already know why they monitoring you. Don't say a word. Just turn your head and mind your business. Turn the other cheek and keep it and keep it pushing. Don't say nothing to these people. Don't get no reaction or nothing. Keep your peace. Let the Lord fight your battles. Because modern spirits will try to catch you off guard and make you want to say something to them. But like I said, keep your peace and let the Lord fight your battles. Don't you let nobody out here take up off your off your path. I don't care how hard they're stirring. Like, I don't care how hard they're stirring at you. I don't care how much they're monitoring you. You keep a cool head. Don't let nobody out here see you sweat or get mad. I mean, we all human. We all gonna get pissed off. But people making us mad, that ain't gonna work. That's a no-no. They gonna get mad trying to piss us off. So when you see people watching you like a hawk, do not react. Just keep doing your thing. Keep smiling. And like I said, stay out the way. Be low-key. Be L-key. Keep it on the L-K. 
keep it on a low key. Or, in other words, keep it on the DL. Shh. Hush. Be quiet. Don't say nothing. Let God do the talking. And let your blessings do the talking. But let them stare all they want to. Because as long as you're here on God's green earth, you're going to continue to get blessed. Wherever they like it or not. So that was the video, ladies and gentlemen. I had to protect yourself from modern spirits. Don't forget, like, comment, subscribe, share this video, and turn your notifications on. And by the way, happy Saturday. God bless you all. And remember, be safe. And be aware of your surroundings. Because these modern spirits, they out there. They out here. It's real out here. And it's serious. But at the same time, you ain't got nothing to worry about. Because God is on your side. And he got your back. Peace.